this year of 2019 and, and how we thank and praise him that we know, amen, that he's still in the miracle working business. He's still in the prayer answering business. Once again, we, this is the Perfect Peace Bible Church Ministry uh, broadcast. Yes, our theme is if you make the step, God will send the help. How we thank and praise God for his multitudes of blessings. Yes, even the storm, pains, and rain that has transfigured in our life. Uh, when we look back over, we see that it was nobody but him that brought us thus far. That's the rejoicing, a statement right there, that whatever, amen, betides you, God has allowed you to see the last Saturday of 2019. Uh, we thank and praise God, yes, for you, my brothers and sisters, yes, that are on the air right now, listen to us at the KTYM broadcast booth right here in the beautiful city of Inglewood, California. We pray now that you will call a friend, tell him once again that the Perfect Peace Bible Church uh, broadcast is on the air. How we thank and praise God for our listeners. Yes, then how we thank and praise God for the Perfect Peace Bible Church. Yes, we are located in the beautiful city of the angels. Yes, Los Angeles, California. Our address is 111-51-53 South Broadway Avenue, zip 90061. Yes, once again, that's the Perfect Peace Bible Church. Yes, in Located in the city of Los Angeles, California, address 111-51-53, South Broadway Avenue. Two buildings in one place, yes. Amen. Our services began on Sunday morning at 10.30 a.m., yes, Wednesday night Bible study and prayer meeting where we designated our family affair. Yes, Sunday school at 12.30 p.m. Yes, we thank and praise God. Amen. For you, amen, that are under the sound of my voice. And then how I thank and praise God for your prayers. Yeah, I thank and praise God for your prayers, that he's still in the prayer answering business. Amen. Yes, how we thank and praise God to be in the studio one more time. And let us not forget how we thank and praise God for our sponsors. Yes, uh, the Lord House of Prayer for all people, uh, Pastor Gregory White. And that church is located at 9318 Southwestern Avenue in Los Angeles, California, 90047. Do hope and pray, amen, that you've had a wonderful and blessed Christmas, yes, and remembering what the celebration was all about first, yes, was all about first, seems that when we get over, amen, up in numbers, we forget about how we did, amen, when we was in our youthful years and how we look for Santa Claus and, and Christmas amen. presents. Yeah, but uh, that's all right. But just remember the reason for the season and put him first. Yeah, amen. put him first, our Lord and Savior Christ Jesus. Yes, go ahead on and celebrate. Yes, but don't forget, amen, him who died one dog Friday, but that wasn't the end of the story. Praise God. Yes. Yes. Amen. Uh, after three days, he got up from the grave. Yeah. With all power, he declared it in his word, all power in heaven and in earth was given unto him. So we thank and praise God that he has brought us through this year. Yes. This December 28th, the last Saturday, 
Um, amen. The year 2019, stretching out into another decade. Oh, bless his holy name. Then how we thank and praise God for uh, another one of our sponsors, Jay's Holland, seen it on uh, Facebook where Jay was uh, scratching the snow off his windshield and declared that if you call, he'll haul. Yes, amen. Give Jay a call at 323 83 Three five two one zero one. Once again, that's Jay's Holland. Three two three. Eight three five two one zero one. And then I'd like to, Amen. Thank you, my brothers and sisters, as we requested your prayers. Yes, and for the first lady. Yes, my only lady is back in the radio booth with us. Amen. God has, Amen, strengthened her to be back in our midst once again. Then I thank and praise God, amen, that at this time, yes, at this time, we'd like to join in with prayer with you. Whatever you're going through, yes, whatever, amen, you desire to give acts of God as we move over into the new year. And that number is 323 Three nine seven nine. This is our number here in the radio booth. Give us a call that we might stand in agreement with you. For the Bible says, amen, that whatsoever you ask, yeah, and believe when you pray, amen, it shall be done unto you. The Bible says, my brothers and sisters, according to Matthew 18 and 19, where two or three are gathered in my name, yes, and standing in agreement and on one accord, there will I be in the midst of. So give us a call on our prayer line. Yes, that's 323-412-3979. Then, amen, if you just want to call and leave a voicemail requesting prayer, our 24-hour prayer line, yes, it's 323-755-7418. That's 323-755-7418. Yes, give us a call, leave your, amen, prayer request and your number so that we can return your call. Yes, we check our messages, and if you left a call, we'll return your call and pray with you and stand in agreement with you that God will, amen, make your request known unto you that he'll manifest it in your life. God bless you, my brothers and sisters. Once again, this is the Perfect Peace Bible Church Ministry. Yeah, and our theme here, our radio broadcast, if you make the step, God will send the help. Yeah, the Bible tells us, amen, that for God so loved the world that he gave his only begotten son, that whosoever believeth in him shall not perish but have everlasting life. Amen. Shall have. Let me say that again. Shall have. Yes. Eternal life. Yes. Amen. So you got to do something. You got to do something. You got to accept him as your Savior. Yes. Amen. Then you got to act and stand upon his word. Yes. I tell people everywhere I go. Yes. Amen. That ain't no man of falling out the sky no more. No, 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 no. Ain't no man of falling out the sky no more. You got to do something. Yes, after you pray, you got to get up and do something. That's what James said, amen. James said, amen, show me your work. Yeah, amen, show me your work, amen. And then I'll show you my works. By faith, I'll show you my work. So you got to believe, amen, when you pray and ask God. That you got to make this step. Praise his holy name. Oh, bless his name. This is our prayer time. Amen. On our radio broadcast. And once again, here in the uh, broadcasting booth, our number is 323 412 
323-412-3979. That's 323-412-3979. Amen. And then I hope and pray that everyone, everyone under the sound of my voice, yeah, that you've had a blessed, amen, Christmas and holiday season up until this hour, and that God will, amen, take you on over into the new year. That's our prayer for you, my brothers and sisters. Amen. Call in. Let us stand in agreement with you. Yes, let us have prayer with you. This is the Perfect Peace Bible Church Ministry. Our theme is, if you make the step, God will send the help. Yes, he will. Amen. I'm a witness. Amen. I'm not just talking, amen, to be saying something, to be killing time here in this broadcast booth. I'm a witness that God does and still answers prayer. Yes, I prayed and I asked, amen, you to pray. Yes, and I asked my brothers and sisters and fellow yokemen to pray for my wife. Yes, amen, and Tonight, amen, she said, I feel like I can go with you. Yes, and she's in the in the radio broadcast booth at this hour as I speak. Yeah, there's power in prayer. Yes, there's power in prayer. That's why Jesus, amen, instructed us and advised us, yes, amen, that man should always pray. And don't get tired of praying, my brothers and sisters, because when you pray, yes, you get heaven's attention. Yes, you do. Amen. So we thank God, amen, for the power of prayer tonight. Amen. Once again, the Perfect Peace Bible Church is located. Yes, it is. It's located at 111-51-53 South Broadway Avenue in the City of the Angels. Yes, Los Angeles, California. 90061 is our zip code. And then, my brothers and sisters, as we finalize this year, yes, we ask, amen, we are asking that if the broadcast is being a blessing to you and to help you in any kind of way, if our prayers, amen, have been answered on your behalf, that you would drop us a postcard in the mail uh, and a donation, yes, a donation to help us, amen, support this broadcast and Keep coming to you with words of encouragement. Yes, words of peace, words of protection, words of joy. Yes, I, I'm grateful tonight. Yes, I have an attitude of gratefulness. Yes, that, Lord. That he didn't have to do it, but he did it. Amen. He has brought us thus far. Yes, the last Saturday of 20. In 19, going over into the new year. Those are my plans, yeah, to go over into the new year. That's how we thank and praise God, amen. We're making preparation not only for tomorrow, yeah, not only for tomorrow, amen. but a Tuesday night as well. The Perfect Peace Bible Church, amen, will be in celebration and worship in our watch night service. Starts at 10 a.m. Yes, we have, amen, coming as guests, the Sunrise Community, yeah, church. Yes, Pastor Joseph Rogers, Jr., the pastor. Yes, we are looking for a great time in the Lord. Yes, we want to bring 2020 in on our knees, praising and thanking God. Yes, thanking God for another opportunity to give him praise, to be a witness for him, yes, to be a servant for him, yes. Be, not only be his friend, but him being our friend. Amen. Yes, we praise and thank Amen. God for you. Oh, yes, this is our prayer time now. This is our prayer time. This is our prayer time. Our number here in the radio booth is 323 412 
3979. Then in, throughout the week, amen, if you, amen, desire prayer, hit us up on our 24-hour prayer line. That's 323-755-7418. Three two three seven five five seven four one eight. And as I told you, Amen. I'm so thankful. I'm rejoicing. Yeah, that. Yeah, uh huh. Yeah, that the first lady, my boo, is in the radio booth with us tonight. Yes, she is. Amen. And she's gonna bless us with songs. And then I'm gonna come back to you and have a few more comments and get right into the word. Oh, bless his holy name. Yes, Sister Ashley. Yes, it's good to be here. Hallelujah. It's good to be here. Hallelujah. I just thank Hallelujah. God for what He's done. Done. Yes. And I'm getting. I'm ready to thank Him later on for what He's going to do. I, amen. And I just, just, I'm just happy to be here. I'm feeling well, and it's all because of Jesus. All because of Jesus. And I just want to. Thank God for you. Thank my God for and doing sisters. that. Praying. So, uh, and I just thank everybody for their prayers and keep keep them going. Don't stop. Okay, I'm gonna sing this song here. I woke up early this morning. My heart was beating right on time. I said, Lord, I truly thank you. For opening up these eyes of mine Then I went over to my window And while looking at the shades Once again I had to tell him Thank you Lord For let me see another day Everybody ought to praise his name Yes Be thankful and praise his name Everybody ought to praise his name. Cause if a robber can say thank you, you can do it too. Now the sun was bright and shining. The wind was blowing not too strong. And in a treetop just a few feet away was a robin singing a song. Now I don't know what he was saying. But pretty soon he was on his way. Who's to say he wasn't being thankful and saying thank you for another day? Everybody ought to praise his name. Be thankful and praise his name. Everybody ought to praise his name. Cause if a robin can say thank you, you can do it too. Oh, you ought to praise his name. Be thankful and praise his name. Everybody ought to praise his name. For if a robin can say thank you, you can do it too. Amen. And I say thank you cause I... I am very thankful Amen. for what Amen. the Lord have done thus far for me. Amen. And is doing. And is doing. Amen. Amen. How we thank and praise uh, First Lady, Amen, Sister Geraldine Ashley, for that rendition and how, Amen, wonderful and how factual and truthful it is. Amen. For 1 Thessalonians 5 and 18, Amen. So give thanks unto God. Yeah, oh, give thanks unto God. Amen. For it is the will. Yes, give thanks unto Christ Jesus. For it is the will of God. Yes, in Christ Jesus for us. And everything that's good and righteous. Amen. Sin is not of God, my brothers and sisters. Amen. And we tend to misinterpret. Amen. And Oh, yes, amen, and present things in a negative manner. But sin is not of the God we serve. Amen. Uh, uh, and murder and rape and then, amen, 
blaspheming the Holy Ghost. That ain't of God. You don't give thanks for that, but you Amen. give thanks for everything that's good and, and righteous. Amen. Amen. Give thanks that God has looked beyond our faults once yes. again and Thank let you, our Lord. time roll on just a little yes. while longer. Oh, yes. yes, I attend uh, quite a few homegoing services and, and celebrations. Amen. But God, in spite of our shortcomings, yes, has smiled upon us and oh, let our yes, time God. roll on just a little while longer. Yes, he yes this is our prayer time, my brothers and sisters. And we are, amen, sitting in the broadcast booth at the KTYM Media Entertainment Radio Station. Yes, amen. And this is our prayer time in the beautiful city of Los Angeles, California. Correction, Inglewood, California. Yes, where I see CEO is Dr. Thomas Blackwell, yes, who has seen a vision, yes, to keep, amen, the gospel moving through social media, World Wide Web, and somebody somewhere, yes, is tuned in to the Perfect Peace Bible Church ministry, where our theme yes. is, if you make the step. God will send the help. Yes, yes. And as a matter of fact, it's already there. Uh, You're going to make the step, amen, and get what God has, amen, provided for you. Get what you have asked God for. Yes, yes. in the name of our Lord and Savior Christ Jesus. Amen. Wherever you're at at this time, whether it's morning, evening, or night, amen, give God some glory. Amen. Yes, give him some glory. Amen. That he has brought you through 52 Saturdays. Yes, yeah, somewhere around the world, on the world wide web, you've already crossed over, yes, into the new year. Somewhere, yes, but give God glory. Yes, Amen. as we here in these United States of America, just with a few hours of time differences, are striving, amen, to get there. And yes, and this, we're on the uh, the West Coast of uh, Pacific Standard Time. Yes, we are a few hours behind, but we are striving to get there, and we are looking yes. to the author and finisher of our faith. I tell you, my brothers and sisters, amen, I just believe, yes, I just believe, amen, if it was more prayer, yeah, if it was more prayer, Yes, if it was more prayer, let me say that again, amen, that we would have a better world. Yes, Amen. if it was more prayer yes, and people will. standing on the word of God. Yes, Amen. yes, he he come, amen, as his word says, amen, to save his people from their sin. Yes, if it was more prayer, yeah, we would have a better world. Yes, yes we would, amen, bring our children up in Sunday school. Yes, you would see less of them, amen, and correctional institution in courtroom. Amen. Yes, amen. There's something about this word. Oh, yes, it is. Yes, Jesus. it is. There's something about this word. There's power in the word. Yes, if you make the step, God will send the help. Once amen. again, we want to thank God for our sponsors. Yes, amen. The Reverend Gregory White, a pastor of the, amen, a house of prayer for all people that's located at 9318 Southwestern Avenue, 90047. Then we want to thank God for Jay's hauling. Jay Amen. said, if you call, he'll haul. Yeah, and that number is 835-2101. Once again, Jay's hauling, 323-835-2101. Yes, we are looking for a better, bigger and better things. Amen. And we strive to cross over, yes, into the new year. Amen. Yeah. 
And I'd come to tell somebody, it won't be about popping and locking, jumping and jacking. No, it'll be about, amen, amen. growing closer to our Lord and Savior, amen. Jesus Christ. That even in the midst, amen, of our, our trials and tribulations, our yes. troubles, we can still, amen, keep our minds stayed on him. Amen. Yes, yes. Because he's a game changer. Yes, he is. Yes, he's yes, a game he changer. And I come to encourage somebody tonight. Draw closer to him. He's a game changer. Yeah, whatever you are going through, amen, some of it is just to develop us and make us a better person. Amen. Yeah. So give him praise tonight. If you make the step, he'll send the help. Once again, amen, our, our prayer line is open right now, and that number is 323-412-3979. Once again, our prayer line here in the radio station is open. That number is 323 Three nine seven nine. How we bless and thank God, Amen, for this privilege as well as this opportunity, yes, to come to you on the world wide web. The Perfect Peace Bible Church is located at one eleven fifty one dash fifty three South Broadway Avenue in the City of Angels, Los Angeles, California nine zero zero. Six one. Our time of worship on Sunday morning starts at ten thirty a.m. Yes, yeah, Sunday school at twelve p.m. Uh, Bible study. Yes, yeah, and prayer meeting on Wednesday night. Yes, on Wednesday night, we call it our family affair that starts at 7 p.m. Come out and stop by, see what the ministry is all about. Yeah, and we're preparing now, yes, for our watch night service, which will be Tuesday. Yes, starting at 10 a.m., uh, 10 p.m., correction, 10 p.m. Our doors will open at 9 p.m., with music and fellowshipping, yes, and then we'll go into our worship service at 10 p.m. And then we hope to be on our knees. Yes, we hope Amen. to be on our knees at 12 a.m. Thanking Amen. and praising God. Thanking and praising God for one more year. Yes, one more year. Yes, and we're Lord. right on the corner of 111th Place and Broadway Avenue. Yes, and the address once again is 111-51-53 South Broadway Avenue. Two buildings and one spot. Yes. Then, uh, my brothers and sisters, once again, if the ministry is being a blessing to you, drop us a postcard in at the church. Yeah. Then we're asking that you would help us, amen, to support this radio broadcast ministry. Yes, amen. We look at all this beautiful equipment amen. that our Dr. Blackwell has in here that we are able to come to you live. Yes, live on at this time every Saturday from 6.30 to 7.30 p.m. And then on the second Saturday, uh, the House of Prayer pastor, Pastor Gregory White, comes Amen, and continue to share with you. Yes. Now, my brothers and sisters, once again, as we said, uh, all this equipment in this radio station, amen, it ain't cheap. Amen. It's quality equipment. Yes, these uh, different kinds of cameras and recording, amen, and key, uh, it's amplifiers and things that, they record us with that we are able to share across the world wide web. So we're asking you that you would help us stay on the air that we might be able to come and share with you. And then you can hear my wife and my beautiful wife, amen, sing those songs that she sang. Yes, and then I'll be sharing, amen, words of wisdom, words of hope peace, joy, words of motivation with you through the Word of God. Amen. Yes. Amen. God bless you. God bless you. We're going to ask Sister Ashley, would she 
Bless us with one more song, then we are going to get into the Word. Once again, our prayer line here in the radio station is 323-412-3979. Our 24-hour prayer line at the Perfect Peace Bible Church is 323-755-7418. God bless you and God keep you. It's Sister Ashley. All right. Ah. Okay. <laughs> All right. The next song I am about to sing should happen to almost to everyone. Mm. And the name of the song is I Found Him, and Him is Jesus. Amen. Amen. And Him is Jesus, and everybody need to find Him. I found him, I found him in time, I found Jesus, I found him in time, I found him, I found him in time, I found Jesus, I found him in time. Sometimes I used to pray, used to cry at night, cause everything was seen like was going wrong. With tears in my eyes, I found Jesus by my side. So I tell it everywhere I go. That Jesus will save your soul. I found Jesus. I found him in time. I found Jesus in time. I found Jesus in time in my soul. I found him. I found him in time. I found Jesus. I found him in time. I found Jesus in time. I found Jesus in time in my soul. He's the sun shining bright. He's the moon coming out at night. He's your friend, your all in all. If you need him, all you got to do is call. I found Jesus in time. I found Jesus in time in my soul. I found Jesus in time. I found Jesus in time in my soul. Amen. 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 And that's a good, that's a good, that's a good, that's a good, amen. Amen. Yes, it is. Song. Yes, it is. That's a good song. Amen. I found Jesus in time. Aren't you glad about it that you found Amen. Jesus in time? Amen. Yes, cause rain, yeah, pain, disappointment will come. Yes. But his word says that if you keep your mind stayed on him. Amen. Yes, he will keep you in perfect peace. If Amen. you trust him. Amen. So that's what we've been doing. Amen. I shared with you that Sister Ashley, amen, was under the weather and going through, uh, amen, some sickness. But we found Jesus in amen. time. And we, amen. And we got the news. We know who to, who to go to first. Amen. Yes, That's we right. went to Jesus in prayer. Amen. Yes, we went to Jesus in prayer. Yes. My brothers and sisters, once again, this is the Perfect Peace Bible Church Ministry here in the radio booth at KTYM Media Entertainment. Yes, amen. And our theme is, if you make the step, God will send the help. Yes, he yes. will. And as we've been journeying through the 
Amen. This trial of faith, yeah, and trust, amen, with the help make my wife, amen, and soliciting your prayers. I want amen. you to know that God has yes. answered your prayers and is answering your prayer. Yes, he is. And that's what we want to talk about tonight as I was meditating and thinking about, amen preaching a sermon and sharing with you about going over into the new year. Well, this is, this fits any time. Yeah, amen. this message tonight fits any time. Mm. Yes, amen. And we want to talk about the power of prayer tonight. Amen. The power of prayer. For we are rejoicing, yes. amen, that God, we know that God is still in the prayer answering business. Yes, he yes. is. I want to ask you to pray for, amen, the Cuppridge family, amen, homegoing service yesterday for one of our dear friends, yes, at the Academy Cathedral. Keep that family lifted up in prayer. Then we want to ask you to pray for our brother and our friend, Bishop McNamee, Lonnie McNamee Sr., for we all stand in the need of prayer. Amen. Yes, amen. And then let amen. us not forget to pray for each other. Amen. amen. Just got the news. Yes, while I was at a home going service, that one of my friends, Brother Aaron King, is in the hospital. So we ask you that you would pray. Yeah, there's power in prayer. Yes, yes it, is. it is. Amen. Amen. And that's what we want to share with you tonight. Amen. The power of prayer. Yes, mm-hmm. in Luke, the 11th chapter, yes, in Luke, the 11th chapter, th- these are Jesus' words, yes, if I'm reading out the open Bible of the King James Virgin, amen, and these are Jesus' words in the 11th chapter and the 24th verse, yes, amen, and it reads as thus, therefore, I say unto you, what things soever you desire, when ye pray, believe that you receive them, and you shall have them. Amen. Uh, let me read that again. The eleventh chapter of Luke and the twenty-fourth verse. <coughs> Therefore I say unto you, what things soever you desire, when you pray, believe that ye receive them. And ye shall have them. Amen. 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 Let's start, just talk about the power of prayer tonight, my brothers and sisters. Amen. To share with you. The, yeah. Amen. And what I consider, amen, the definition of prayer, that prayer is an approach to God in word or thought, whereby we earnestly thank and praise him and Humbly make our requests and supplication known to him. Yeah, what we usually call the Lord's Prayer recorded in Matthew, yeah, the sixth chapter, uh, is really, amen, how Jesus taught his disciples to pray. And because this is the prayer that Jesus taught his disciples to pray, then we should pray it as well. But in it, he taught them how to think in terms of our, yeah, <clears throat> our. And in my comments and commentary <coughs> on the beginning of the broadcast, I share with you that if there were more prayer, yeah, if, if there were more prayer in the churches, amen, in the world, amen, not just for selfish reasons, but as Jesus said, our Father, yes, he, he belongs to all of us, my yes, brothers and sisters. Yes, he does. Amen. Not just the selfish of my, but our Father. And if we would come together on one accord here at the KTYM radio um, broadcast and, yeah, media entertainment, 
every year in October, we have an annual worldwide prayer day. Yes, and this president and CEO, amen, request that just everybody that takes the time out, amen, during that day and just pray and don't just pray for selfish reason, amen, but pray that there might be peace. Amen. Yeah, that there might be peace. Yeah, and we need to hear that, amen. And prayer, amen, gets heaven's attention. Amen. That's why Jesus told us in Luke 18 and 1 that we ought to always pray and don't get tired of praying. What a mighty God we serve, amen, that he loves to hear, amen, our prayer and praise. He loves to hear, amen, our supplications and our requests. And I thank God, yes, tonight for your prayer. Amen. amen. And so, amen. amen, the power of prayer, when Jesus was teaching those disciples, amen, that when you pray, amen, pray on one accord. Yeah, pray on one accord. That our Father, yes, too many times we'll pray in selfish prayer. Yeah, and don't just think, amen, that you the only one that's going through. Amen. amen. Because if you took the time to just take a look around you, you would always find somebody in worse shape than you. Amen. Amen. I, I thought about how God had blessed, amen, even in the midst of Sister Ashley's illness and going through, amen, and I thought about how God used that, yeah, to bring, amen, family together, and I just began to give him thanks and praise, amen, we had a sister that fly all the way from the East Coast, amen, out here, our oldest daughter, amen, took the time out of her busy schedule and came and yeah, spent yes, two did. weeks, amen, with her mother, amen. Yes. Uh, oh, there's power in prayer. Yes, yes amen. Yes, and yes. don't be so quick, amen, to get upset and, and displeasing, yes. yes, amen, with situations and conditions. Because sometimes, amen, the God of our salvation take that to develop us and, amen, put trust in him and amen. know that he He's a God that we can lean and depend on. Yes, he is. Yes, yes. He is. I think about, yes, amen, the power of prayer when it said, Our Father, give expression to this thought of coexistence whereby self-actualization is found only in the fellowship with other human beings, with the awareness that God is all of our fathers, yes, yes and all men are brothers, yes, that his only begotten son who thought it not robbery to be equal with him just didn't die, amen, for the Jews, but he died for all of us. Amen. Yes, amen, amen. for that's what the messenger Gabriel said, amen. It's in the book, amen, when he told Mary, amen, that his name shall be called Jesus and he shall save his people from their sin. Amen. Yes, that included all of us. Yes, he did. Amen. And I tell people, amen, if you end up in that lake of fire, it won't be Jesus' fault. All right. Oh, amen. no, amen. And then he goes on, amen, to say in that, amen, disciples' prayer, thy kingdom and thy will teaches us to establish an I, thy relationship with God through humble submission. Yes, amen, and obedience to his will. Yes, if anything I want in my life, I want it to be the will of God. Amen. Yeah, my Lord and Savior, Christ Jesus, as I was sharing today, amen, in discussion, amen, that the command that we shall be a witness, yes, in this sin-sick world, that God is still in the soul-saving business. Yes, yes yeah. we shall pray, amen, for our strength, amen, yes, that yes. God will, yes. amen, keep us strong, yes, in his will and his way. Yes. 
That's why, yes, amen, the prophet Isaiah could declare, yes, amen, when the question was asked, who will go for us? And he said, I'll go. Send me. That that should be, amen, our mindset and our mind thought as we move over into the new year that God has smiled upon us. Yes, let us see 52 Saturdays. Yes, 52 Saturdays. Yes, it's still blood running warm in our veins. Whatever betides us, yes, he has kept us. Yeah, so let us go into the new year with prayer on these lips of clay. Oh, yeah. Yeah. I'll come to ask you tonight, my brothers and sisters. Yes, you that are under the sound of my voice. Uh Uh-huh. Do you have the power of prayer? Yeah, do you have the power of prayer? And I want to encourage you to let you know, yes, that you have the power of prayer. Amen. Yes. A a disciple, amen, is one who follows Jesus. Yes. Amen. A Christian, yeah, is a Christian who loves Christ. Yeah. Who loves him. Yeah. Through faith and belief and live in the hopes of his promises. If he said it, amen, we'll believe, yes, that he will do it. Yes, he will. It's right there in the text, y'all. Therefore, I say unto you. Yeah, what things soever you desire when you pray, yeah, just believe, yeah, that you have received it. Yeah, uh huh. Yes, live in the hope of his promises and Amen. keep his commandment through fellowship, yes, and fellowship, yes. yeah. Keep his commandment. And, and and the Bible says, amen, and it came to pass that he was praying in a certain place when he ceased, one of his disciples said unto him, Lord, teach us to pray. As John also taught his disciples, Luke 11 and 1. And we see here that even John, the forerunner of Jesus, knew the power of prayer. Yes, amen. For he wasn't only a man down in the river Jordan in the wilderness, amen, preaching, but he was teaching and praying as well. Amen. Amen. And I'd come to tell you and encourage you tonight, my brothers and sisters, amen, that that is the reason I believe John was so successful. Yeah, that he knew, amen, the power of prayer. The disciples desired this mysterious power, amen, after observing how the people were leaving town to go down into the wilderness, amen, and hear this man of God, yeah, praying, yes, praying, talking to God. Amen. I tell you, amen, when you talk to God on the daily, he'll show up. Yeah. Yes, yes, he'll show up. Amen. And then not only does prayer, amen, there's power in prayer, but it proves, amen, through this method of prayer that men can get together with God like a child gaining an audience with his father for for consultation. In other (laughs) words, for counsel. Yes, amen. And I believe that in Luke 18, 1, that that's why, amen, our Lord, Lord and Savior Christ Jesus requires us and instructs us, yes, amen, and advised us that man should always pray amen. and not faint. Amen. Yes, amen, because simply saying that God uh, of our salvation, our Lord and Savior Jesus Christ uh, loves, uh, yes, uh, hears, uh, communicate uh, with him. Yes, yes, he, does. Uh, yes he, he does. loves, uh, amen, and uh, the hears, uh, acknowledge, uh, amen, that uh, we can't uh, do nothing without him. Uh, amen. Yes, uh, amen. amen, that's good uh, and righteous. Uh, Yes, uh, he loves uh, to hear 
our concerns. Uh, yes, yes yeah. uh, even though uh, he already knows, uh, he wants to know uh, where our mind uh, set is. Uh, yes, yes uh, amen. Uh, there is, uh, my brothers and sisters, uh, power in uh, the words of prayer. Amen. Yes, uh, amen. Uh, amen. One of the Lord's close disciples, James, uh, teaches us from experience that uh, the effectual, fervent prayer of a righteous man avails much. Uh, amen. amen. Uh, that's James uh, 5 and 16. Uh, uh-huh. And, uh huh. I come uh, tonight uh, to share with you that uh, it's mighty good when one can uh, speak uh, experientially of this uh, mysterious power Amen. that connects uh, our requests uh, yeah, uh, with God's answer. Yes, uh, there are certain characteristics of prayer yeah, that uh, marks the righteous prayer Amen. that uh, veil it much uh, uh -huh. fundamental of uh, them all is uh, recognition of the character of God and his relationship to us. Uh, amen. Uh, why would uh, God uh, ask yourself, uh, my brothers and sisters, uh, tell us that uh, if we should uh, always pray and uh, Amen. In other words, uh, not faint me simply. Amen. Uh, don't uh, give up on prayer. Amen. Yes. Uh, Amen. But you must realize that your time is uh, not God's time. Amen. Uh -huh. right. I told you earlier right. yesterday, uh, Amen, that uh, some of uh, trials and tribulations, uh, yes, uh, some of uh, storms of life, uh, yes, uh, just to develop us, yeah, Amen. just to uh, build up our faith, uh, yeah, yes, that uh, yes. we might, uh, yes, uh, Amen, uh, build up. Uh, oh, great God, uh, thank you, Holy Ghost, uh, Amen. Uh, regularity in prayer. Some of us, uh, Amen. Get up in the morning and uh, don't take the time to tell the Lord, uh, thank you for another day. A uh, oh, great God, uh, we know, uh, amen, that uh, there are many, yeah, that are much more uh, worthy than us That's in right. our own uh, estimation. Uh, yes. Yes, yes, that uh, God has uh, called them from oh, yes, labor he did. to yes, reward. He did. Uh, yes, yes. Uh, yeah. Tell you, uh, there's power in prayer. Yes, yes. Uh, amen. Uh, a righteous prayer. James says, uh, avail as much. Uh, yes. yes um, uh -huh. First, my brothers and sisters, in the power of prayer, there is a condition. Uh, yes, it is. Um, we must approach God. Uh, yes, and uh, three things. Uh, yes, uh, amen. Uh, we must have a clean heart. Uh, yes, uh, God uh, uh, can't uh, uh, deal with, uh, yes, on the righteous side with an envious heart. Uh, amen. amen. Uh, that heart, uh, all it thinks about is me, mine, and that's enough. Uh, yes. Uh, and then um, we must have uh, faith that uh, God can and does uh, answer our prayer. Ooh, yes. yes the yes, adversary would yes, think that because uh, he don't answer when you want want him to, uh, amen, that uh, right. there is uh, no need to pray. But I come uh, yeah. Yeah, yeah. to encourage you, uh, amen, to keep on uh, praying. Uh, yeah, amen. keep 
on uh, talking yes, uh, uh, yes. The, the God of uh, our salvation. Uh, keep on, uh, even in the midst of uh, storms, uh, yes, uh, even in the midst of uh, look like uh, it ain't going to uh, never happen what you prayed for, yes, but uh, I come to encourage you tonight, uh, yes, I did, that uh, he's an on time God. Uh, oh, yes, he yes, he is. Yes, he is. Yes. He's an on time God, my brothers and sisters. Yes. yes. Amen. You might get bruised. Amen. You might get wounded. Yes. But uh, if, amen, you keep praying, yes, he will come through. Yes, he will. Yes. yes Prayer will. is to encourage our mind and all our strength and yes. our supplication unto yes. God. Prayer is to meditate on uh, in his law, in other words, uh, in his word, uh, day and night. Uh, yes, uh, prayer yeah. is to pray that God's uh, will be done. Yes, yes, uh, oh, yes prayer, amen, yes, is to pray uh, for ourselves and pray for others. Amen. And I thank you for your prayers. Yes, yes, yes. on the behalf of, uh, amen, uh, not only the Perfect Peace Bible Church Ministry, but I thank you for your prayers, amen, for my first lady, uh, Sister Ashley. Yes, uh, you, amen. Uh, you, the Bible teaches you. us, uh, yes, to even pray uh, for our enemies. Uh, yes, yes uh, famine and hunger is an enemy. Inflation is an enemy. Sickness is an enemy. Yes, Neglect yes. of a prayer life is an enemy. Amen. Yes, uh, amen. And when you uh, fail to pray, uh, yeah, the adversary takes control. Um, oh, yes, amen. He does. Uh, yes, he does. Prayer is to pray uh, yes, in does. Jesus' name and yes. ask for uh, the things uh, that will promote uh, his kingdom uh, on earth. Uh, yes, uh, that's what uh, we're <laughs> saved uh, to do. Yes. And uh, I'm like, uh, amen. Uh, King David said uh, in Psalm number 30, yeah, I've been young, uh, amen, but now I'm old, and I've never seen the righteous forsaken of the seed uh, begging bread, uh, amen. Uh, I got a whole lot more I want to say, but uh, my time has come to an end, so merry, merry, happy, happy new. New Year. Amen. Amen. Our prayer is that God will uh, take us all uh, over into the new year. My brothers and sisters, God bless you. God Amen. keep you is our prayer. Yes, this is the Perfect Peace Bible Church. Amen. Like we say, we'll be having watch night service. Our doors will swing open at 9 a.m. We'll start our worship and praise service. Amen. At, uh, at 9 p.m. Start our worship and praise service at 10 p.m. Amen. Stop by. Amen. Amen. Come on out. Let us lift up the name of Jesus in yes. prayer and praise as he takes us over into the new year. Once Amen. again, that address is 111-51-53 South Broadway Avenue, right on the corner of 111th Place and Broadway Avenue Amen. in the city of Los Angeles, California, 90061. Yes, amen. Stop by, see what the ministry is about. Then, amen, we ask that you would drop us a postcard or drop us, a, amen, a donation to help us stay on the air. Amen. God bless you. God amen. keep you is our prayer. Amen. Happy, happy New Year. Hope your Christmas was as blessed as ours was. Amen. And let us not forget to amen. pray for those that are amen. unfortunate than us. Uh, yes, amen. That there is power in prayer. God bless you. God keep you is our prayer. Yes, it do. 
what you do. I just say thank you, Lord. Thank you, Lord. No, I, no, I won't. No, I, I won't complain. Clouds hang low